In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to zoom track in DaVinci Resolve 17 and 18. So we're going to hop over to our edit tab in DaVinci Resolve. So here we have a video on Roblox of my friend jumping off a cliff and shouting loud. One. So what we're going to do is we're going to try track him while he's jumping down. The way we're going to do this is we're going to go over and select the clip and go over to our inspector, which you'll need turned on. We're going to add this keyframe at the very top. It's opposite transform and click on it. You're going to zoom in and then you're going to position it to where you want your first frame to be. Once you have this zoom set, you can't change this unless you want to zoom in or out. But if you just want to track something, it has to say the same zoom. So now you want to go along your video by millisecond by just tapping the right arrow key. And every time something substantial changes, you're going to add a new keyframe at the top and position it to center again and keep repeating this may take quite a while because it is not frame by frame but it is very slowly repositioning the camera to the object if you would like me to make a automated zoom track video about how to just automatically do this without having to do keyframes it is a lot easier but more complicated I will make that if we get enough comments. All right, so here we get to the bit where he's falling off quite quickly. So we may have to make a keyframe literally every millisecond. Every, that's two milliseconds right there. We have to make a new one. We don't want to leave him out of frame at all because then it's not going to look good. And then once he goes off the screen, like there, we can't see him anymore. So we just leave it. So as our final result, we get this. Three, two, one. If this works for you, consider liking and subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.